Hey Amanda, George here, and in this video I want to talk about my evidence for participation in uh, learning regarding the uh, Shifting to Remote Learning course. Um, I've, number one, learned to look into the camera. I think that's a big one. And two, someday my goal in the next two weeks is to put up a, like a catchy chika chika sound at the beginning of all my videos and at the end, like you see it for like Bozeman science. Uh, anyway, evidence, I'll stop lathering. Uh, I've done at least five of the sessions for the district uh, collaborations, um, the no access assignments for students that don't have the technology, the Zoom one, I led that one, and then the balancing online and offline curriculum with Kim was, that was really, actually, that was probably one of the most helpful ones, thinking about how students will engage in the course and something I'm still trying to figure out going forward. If I would rebuild courses that are going to be, I have a lot of room for blending courses into the future. So that's, that's probably a whole other thing. Um, other big things, have, uh, I've spent an inordinate amount of time working with our staff um, at Seward Secondary on like, how are we going to communicate with students? This is in the first two weeks that we were collaborating on things. Um, how we could even build a schedule that would work for all of our students so we're not stepping on each other's toes or office hours that won't align. Um, have also, at least probably two hours a week working with the aides who are, are, are jumping into my classes and getting feedback from them on how I can make the courses more accessible to students, meaning I'm meeting their IEPs, but I'm not changing the fundamental content um, so my readers can read. Um, and my students that need help going through it, there's video and uh, text to go with stuff. And then I, I've definitely I've kind of been one of Seward's uh, high school's tech guys. I'm spending a lot of time, especially early on, not so much in the past week, but like helping older teachers use Canvas, like Dan and Ron, uh, or, or Zach, or how to lay up courses, or how to put um, requirements on courses, uh, showing people how to do screencasts, other technology things. Uh, I'd say I'm probably well over 25 hours on uh, this list, um, but actually I kind of enjoy it too, so it's not so bad. All right, two minutes, that's long enough.